What is the difference between the prophetic office and the gift of prophecy? Let's find out in this video. Please don't forget to go to the description and follow the links that are provided. We have introduced many links if you want to learn more about the Word of God. The prophetic office and the gift of prophecy are both mentioned in the Bible, but they serve different purposes within the church. The prophetic office refers to a special role given to certain individuals who are called by God to be His prophets. These individuals have a long-term ministry and are responsible for delivering God messages, providing spiritual guidances, and sometimes even performing miracles. For example, in the book of Ephesians 4, 11 to 12, Paul says that Christ gave some to be apostles, some prophets, some evangelists, and some pastors and teachers to equip his people for works of service so that the body of Christ may be built up. Prophets like Isaiah, Jeremiah, and Ezekiel were called to this office and had significant roles in guiding Israel. The gift of prophecy, on the other hand, is a spiritual gift given by the Holy Spirit to believers for the purpose of strengthening, encouraging, and comforting the church. Unlike the prophetic office, the gift of the prophecy is not a lifelong calling and can be given to any believer at any time. In 1 Corinthians 12.10, Paul lists the gifts of prophecy among those spiritual gifts and in 1 Corinthians 14.3, he explains that the one who prophesies speaks to people for their strengthening, encouraging, and comfort. This gift allows believers to receive and share specific messages from God as needed. An example of prophetic office is found in the life of prophet Samuel. From a young age, Samuel was called by God to be a prophet and he served in this role throughout his life. He anointed the first two kings of Israel, Saul and David, and provided guidance to the nation. We read that in 1 Samuel 3.20 and 1 Samuel 16.13. This shows how the prophetic office involves a long-term commitment and significant responsibility in leading God's people. Whereas in contrast, the gift of prophecy can be seen in the New Testament with individuals like Philip's daughters and Agabus. Acts 21, 9-10 mentions that Philip had four daughters who prophesied, and Agabus, a prophet, predicted a famine and warned Paul about its upcoming arrest. These instances show that the gift of prophecy can be given to different believers to meet specific needs and provide timely messages from God. The prophetic office is a long calling with border responsibility and leadership within the church. While the gift of prophecy is a spiritual gift given to any believer for specific purpose and times to build up the church.